Well, honestly, when I was in secondary school, the thing I wanted to do most was program the flying car, uh, robots for NASA, and maybe even the software for the Air Force jets. So I thought, okay, computer science, I'll give it a go. It's in the top 180 in the world as well. And of course, you have the Mardike Arena with the gym, you have the clubs, you have the AstroTurf, uh, the swimming pool, everything. There's uh, campus is beautiful, the library is nice. I suppose there's plenty of things to do really. There was a petting zoo yesterday to re relieve exam stress. It just shows you know, what you know, everyone is really working towards helping the students. So overall, it's, it's a nice university, it's worth it. it it's not essential, but it's, it's definitely a big part of the course. Um, you don't necessarily have to be good at maths. When I came in, I wasn't great at maths. Um, there's a lot of software engineering, understanding why projects succeed and why they fail, um, the best practices to do for projects, to give for projects. Um, then there's your own project as well, which doesn't even have to be programming. During computer science, the main skills I developed would be uh, communication skills, I suppose. There'd be uh, team working as well. We had a team project in third year, which involved three different students working on a project together, which I enjoyed very much. Um, independence skills, basically being able to work on your own projects as a base of what we've learnt in computer science. Um, programming skills as well, of course. There's plenty of different modules that we learn uh, different types of programming, such as, I suppose, the main languages using industry, Java, Objective-C, things like that. I think the most valuable part of the course is being able to work on your own projects outside of working hours. Say for example, uh, last summer I learned how to develop an Objective-C and I made a couple of applications myself that are now live in the iPhone store. Um, I've made a couple of websites for different businesses, a few systems for companies here in Cork and in Dublin, which I feel are a big part of the experience which I can place on my CV. Um, all accountable basically through CS. Uh, for work experience I was working for a startup medical company. So from day one, uh, my first task was to develop a small website for use by bedside uh, systems in hospitals. That went well and basically for the, the vast majority of my work experience, I was creating an iPhone application. So that application was made to uh, basically make an oncologist work easier. So they, they can diagnose their patients with higher uh, levels of accuracy, I suppose. So it was basically the application was made up of prognostic calculators and tools, graphs and charts and those kind of things, in-app purchases, so it was, it was a good experience to develop the application. There was a lot of things that were relevant, but of course there's always plenty more things that you have to pick up by yourself. For example, uh, software engineering was very helpful. Um, we had weekly scrum meetings during placement, we had uh, extreme programming sessions which means you program very quickly over a couple of hours, things like that, so there's, there's a lot of things you can't prepare for. But I think the modules, for example Java in particular, did help uh, understanding programming a lot, so it was quite helpful. That was definitely my most favourite part of the whole course. Um, for my Fortune project, I developed a diabetic iPhone application. So the main idea behind that was to help diabetes management. So anything that might be difficult for a diabetic to organise themselves, put it all into one application, make it easier, pro provide it for free on the app stores currently live, and um, basically break down everything that they're finding difficult into one application.